Mom says, it's time to go. We have to check out at 11. Go downstairs, put my stuff in the car. Checks out. Come back up in these chicks. Hey, over here. Somebody living a lotion. Bag is in the room. Somebody leaving a bag. Uh, conditioner. Somebody leaving a mouthwash. And then when I say it, they're going to say, we know we got. Okay, so y'all better have everything out of this room. Somebody got their shoes right there. Is in the truck. Was in the trunk before it was time to check out. I already yeah, gave a lady the keys. It's time to go. Okay. I don't got time for people to be playing with my to be playing with my time. Yeah. Yeah. I don't give a damn what you don't want to be on. You in my presence, you on my camera. Yeah, you will. Oh, yeah. 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 I can record you. There's not a law against that. Yeah, and you're in public. Actually, no, it's not. If you're in public places, this is why content creators can create content and get away I'm with so it. But you're in public. Let her sue me. I'm gonna burst her. Yeah, sue me. Try, try me, and stop being a dick writer. Nobody's talking to you. There was a nail spa across the street from the hotel, so we went and got our pedicures before starting our day. Okay, so we are at Kumbu and Mall. My daughter had to come up here and get some stuff. I'm probably gonna get some stuff as well. And then my oldest daughter gonna meet with us later. So stay tuned. Cumberland Mall is a mall that we used to go to a lot when we lived in Atlanta. Of course, we had to stop by Victoria's Secret. So my daughter, uh, she wanted to grab a lot of things. And of course, I did too. This little blue set really caught my eye. This is cute. I like the details in it. The material felt good. This set was also cute too. I was liking the details with the... Um, acrylic jewels uh that was really cute and then they had different styles so that one's like a mid half corset bra that was cute as well and then my youngest daughter caught herself trying to measure my waistline which she did not know she's doing i was trying to teach her and these new kids they don't want you to show you nothing they don't want you to show them nothing they think they know everything and they don't and i was trying to teach her like let me show you the right way. She didn't want to listen, but my second oldest daughter was like, Mommy, show me. I want to know. And so I was like, Girl, I got you. Because this should be my thing. Like, I used to waist train. I haven't done it in some years. I need to get back to it. But anyway, so you just take the number one and then you bring it around and it's going to measure. I used to be a 29 in the waist. I am now like a 32, 32. 30, it's like 32. We're going to stay right there. I think that's what it said. But um, I need to get it back down to 29. So anyway, she came back and I'm like, let me show you. And she's like, no, no, no. I'm like, in order for you to learn, you have to let somebody teach you. You cannot learn if you don't allow yourself to be taught. But anyway, she didn't want to. They had a great sale going on for St. Patrick's Day. You get 10 underwear for $40. And of course, you, <laughs> I got some. My kids got, yeah, we got those. That was a really great sale. Um, my two younger daughters was talking about having like a pajama party us doing something so they're trying to pick out which ones they would right. want to get or whatever and so anyway we're going to go check out my daughter still was shopping getting her some stuff the oldest one and while i got my bag on to the next door